Hello friends, welcome to today's video. I wanted to do something different today, hence this voiceover. I was actually hesitant about sharing this flip through as I've spilled so much guts in these pages. The snippets you see on my journal account are just a fraction of what I've done in these pages, which are mostly just words. Some days I end up writing six pages or more. Some days I don't, but I never forget to write something every day. This journal is actually experimental for me. I haven't done something as colorful since I was in high school, and it's also my first binder journal. I used to search high and low for the best blank journals, but I guess I just wanted a little change this time. Just a thought as I'm writing this, isn't it cool that it's like I'm writing a letter to you, or is it just me? Okay, I'm getting sidetracked. Anyway, my 10th journal has definitely helped me over the past months. I felt like I was in a rut, and I didn't know that adding some color on my spreads would make the biggest difference. It's like I felt more alive. I've been journaling since high school, but the joy these pages gave me is something else. There were multiple nights where I slept with Journal 9 beside me to keep the thoughts at bay. Writing will always bring me comfort. It's quite funny actually. I write all day, I get tired, and my mind goes blank sometimes. But when it comes to writing about my thoughts, I can go on all day. I used to think that I would never fall for colorful stickers and all, but look at where we are now. I'm close to consuming all my favorite sticker sheets. The ones you've seen on my previous hauls are nearly gone. That's how much I've been enjoying this new format. I find the process of choosing stickers fun, although I admit there are times where I get really anxious. I mean, really anxious. <laughs> there are previous videos where I was shaking, I had to stop recording and take a break. I couldn't believe it myself that it actually happened to me, but the feeling was just overwhelming. It was a mixture of fear and anxiety because I just want to look, I just want everything to look perfect as a perfectionist, but hey, I had to stop recording and take a break. I don't even show myself anymore on my videos, but that's for another conversation. I feel like I've been spilling too much here already, but I hope you're having a fun time with me. I hope you'll find the same joy in journaling because it's really fun. It's all, I'll always make time for it, that's for sure. This wasn't even supposed to be a journal 10, but I finished it in a month. I had too much fun with my first binder journal and I'm having lots of fun with journal 11 as well. I'm enjoying the bigger space and I've been using more photos as well. I honestly don't know how long this has been but I'm grateful you're spending a few minutes of your day with me. And that is the end of what I wrote last night but hey you still have a few minutes. Um, I'm really thankful because I have this platform to like share everything that I love and that is journaling and I'm also thankful for everyone who has been supporting my small store. It means a lot to me and I truly truly hope that you will fall in love with writing as well. I hope you remember to take care of yourself every day. It's okay to fall back sometimes as long as you know how to get up. My DMs are always open if you want to talk or something. So, yay! Thank you for spending some time with me today. See you next week!